He was left to die in the road, but an 11 year old Polk County boy is home tonight recovering. This is Night Tide. I'm Dave Wagner. And I'm Carolina Lead. Zion McMillan was hit by a driver on the way to the bus stop last week. The man behind the wheel rushed away from the scene. The impact kept Zion in the hospital for several days tonight. The 11 year old is home and speaking only to 10 Tampa Bay's Angelina Salcido. Come on that, son. Uh. At just 11 years old. Be careful, watch your leg. Zion McMillan is a survivor. You all right? Yes, sir. The sixth grader is recovering after he was hit by a car last Tuesday. His faith got him here. Philippians 4 and 19 tells us what? I can do all things through Christ, which gives us. That's it. On this day last week, Zion left home for school. A few minutes later, a driver in his neighborhood hit him while he was walking to the bus stop with a friend. I was with my friend, and after that, I just remember being in a helicopter. That's all you remember? Yes, ma'am. So did you know that you had been hit? I didn't know until I got to the hospital. Zion was airlifted to Orlando Health Arnold Palmer Hospital for children with his dad. He's a real trooper. Jarvis Alston was by his son every day. With a broken leg and injuries to his face, Zion prayed he'd make it out of the hospital. God, come keep me here. Despite his strength and tenacious attitude, he isn't too sure about walking to the bus again. I'm a little traumatized. I'm traumatized, you know, and it wasn't me that actually got hit. The family is now pushing for safety changes in their Point Sienna neighborhood and a closer bus stop. That's what I'm going to do to make sure not only my kids are OK, but the entire community is safe. While the man who left Zion in the road is behind bars, this 11 year old wants everyone to know. You can forgive because the Bible said you got to forgive. With a few months of rehab to go, this football player hopes he'll be on the field next season. Take your time. He's a walking reminder of how quickly the game of life can change. He's weighing on me, man, that, you know, I'm, my son is here. You know, uh, Thanksgiving holiday time, man, and I can't be more thankful. In Polk County. One, two, three, there you go. Angelina Salcedo, 10 Tampa Bay. He is a remarkable young man there. <laughs> Polk County deputies say 66-year-old Pierre Carmela Jacinth was arrested and charged with leaving the scene of a crash with injuries and tampering with evidence after he hit his car in his garage. Deputies say he told detectives he hit a child by accident and panicked. Surveillance cameras caught him rushing to leave.